Another fourth quarter meltdown for the Nets, who went ice cold and could not score again late in the fourth quarter, results in the season being over for the team with the highest payroll in the NBA. The Heat would just not be denied as the big three combined for 73 points and they advanced to their fourth straight Eastern Conference Finals. About two or three minutes left, I think we had like a seven to ten point lead. Just playing too cautious, you know, playing against the clock, not being aggressive, making plays. Then the clock get down to like five or three and then taking, you know, tough shots. So, uh, you know, we made it hard on ourselves. We just came up short, you know, in the game of inches. You know, right there, we, we played as hard as we could, but sometimes we didn't play smart. Uh, you know, and that's the way the ball bounces sometimes. We need to stop down the stretch. We didn't get them. We needed rebounds. Uh, we gave up offensive rebounds. You know, uh, things sometimes have to go perfect when you play against uh, the best team in the NBA. And, you know, we almost put together the perfect game, but we came up short. A little disappointing. You know, the season comes to an end. Work hard, work hard in the off season, uh, all season long. You know, now it's over. Let's not forget that this Nets team was assembled to win now, but according to Jason Kidd, it's not quite that simple. He said, quote, we came up short. It's a process. We just put this together, and now it's time to keep the process moving forward and getting better. Both him and Billy King have a lot to think about now in the offseason, which begins now. In Miami, Michelle Yu, SNY.